we're going to try completing the square. And we have a normal x squared type of quadratic. Step one is going to be to add this 5 to both sides. You want to get rid of c. So we're going to add 5 to both sides of this equation. So we have this. You should leave some space between the 5 and the equal sign because we're going to need to add something in there. To complete the square, you take a look at b, and you take half of this number, and then add that half squared. So we're going to add negative 3 squared. Now remember, if you added something to one side of the equation, you must add it to the other. So on the other side, we're going to actually add the 3 squared which is 9. Now we're going to clean this mess up. On this side of the equation, we're going to say y plus 14. And we're going to say that that is equal to the complete square here, which is x minus 3. You use the number that is in here. And the whole thing is squared. Now, all you need to do is leave it in this form, which is vertex format, or you can bring the 14 over by subtracting it from both sides, and you will now have an easily graphable quadratic.